Hey guys, welcome back to my channel today. So today I have with me my Macy's Beauty Box. This is for October 2022. So this is our newest box. Macy's is a beauty subscription that will send you travel size and sample size products. Occasionally, they will surprise you with a full size product. It's not impossible, but it's not very often either. So if you go into purchasing this, just know that it's usually travel sized or sample sized items. The one thing that I love about this box that a lot of other beauty subscriptions do not have is they will send you fragrances every month. Typically you receive two to three fragrances. I love that, especially because fragrances are so expensive. So I do find that that's what makes this unique. You never know though what you're going to get with the Macy's box. I will tell you guys, they don't release spoilers. You have no idea what's coming until you open up the box. So this is a true mystery to me because sometimes it's really good and sometimes it's not. But we're going to go ahead and open up the October box. If you guys want to purchase this, I will post a link down below in the video description. It is only $15. So in the beauty world of subscription boxes, it's not not that expensive, but we're gonna go ahead and open it up and see if it's worth it. Inside of your box, you will have your pink little bundle of goodies. I was gonna say bundle of joy, but that would be kind of weird. So this is where all your products are. They always wrap them up like this. And then, oh look, this is starting to become a regular thing. We have the classic oops card. So the oops card means that they had to substitute an item that was supposed to be in your box and they're gonna say this is what it was and instead they substituted it for something else. So the theme that we have is bold and bright and there is a retail value of $43.49 on this box. The month of dark and stormy drama is getting a taste of the bright life. Meet a mix of color, shine, and all the exciting makeup staples we can't live without. So the first item that I have, I think is our free item. Usually you'll receive one free sample item from Macy's. And because this does not have a brand on it, I'm guessing that's what this is. So this is our little round container. I don't even know what you'd use this for. It's kind of a small beauty holder. Would you use this as like a Oh look, there's a mirror in here even. So maybe you would put compacts in here, like your blush or bronzer or something. So you've got a little holder down below. There is a mirror that flips down and then this is the zippered part up top here. So it's unique. I, you can't fill this with a lot of stuff is the only thing. So maybe this would just be for your quick touch ups. Maybe add powder in here. So my first official item inside of the box then is from Mineral Fusion. This is going to be a nail polish and this is in the shade Pretty in Pink. It is 10 mil that we received here. It looks like it's a full size nail polish. I would be shocked if this isn't just because it's a fairly large container. I think it's also a good shade. Now, Mineral Fusion is really awesome because it's a nail polish that actually has minerals in it for your nails. So when you put it on, it not only looks nice, but they're actually conditioning and giving your nails nutrients to make stronger, healthier nails than for future wear. So this product is $8.99 for the full size version. And it says that this is going to be a lovely and sweet shade. And it says, Says that this is going to make you shine like a star and it will glide on with ease. So it doesn't say whether or not this is full size, but I'm inclined to believe so. So I mean, that's kind of cool that we get a $9 nail polish in here. Next item that I have is from MAC. We have their mascara. Now this is their travel size version at 10 ounces or three mil of product. This mascara though is really good. So I've tried this in the past. And I do think it delivers on really long lashes. It will give you a lot of height. And especially the more coats you do, the longer it will build on your lashes as well. I felt like I could get spider lashes with this mascara. So it is a black mascara that we have. The full size version on this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is not supposed to be in here. So this is actually the substitution for something. I just don't know what we're substituting just yet, so we'll keep looking for it. But I don't think this is a bad substitution because I actually like this mascara. Next up we have from Nude Sticks. This is one of their little nudies. And this is an all over face blush. So this is going to be your travel size product. Again though, I like this color. This shade is real natural. This is basically a cream blush that you're able to rub on then. 
and it will actually blend out very well. It's a really great brand. It's a great color. It's called Rosy Posy is the name of this shade. It's an ultra soft balm and it will give you a natural look for your eyes, your cheeks, and your lips. So you could use this for more than just blush. I always feel kind of weird about that though. I like when my products are just for one thing. I never want to like, I don't know, mix and match and put them all over. Next up I have from, oh, this is that three Ina. This is going to be a pen eyeliner and it looks blue. I mean, I hope it's this shade of blue. So this is what it looks like here on my packaging. This also appears to be full size. So this is 0.34 ounces or one mil. I think we have a blue eyeliner. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so excited if we did. So this is so much fun when I get color. Whoa, look at that. Oh, I'm so excited. So first off, love the fine point. It also goes down really quickly. Like a lot of product comes out right away. So it's not tugging, it's not pulling. It literally just glides on and you get instant pigment payoff. I mean, I do like this formula already just based off of that. The color is spot on. So far, all I'm looking for is how fast it dries, which to me, it seems like it's already dried down. So I think that's quick. The other thing I check for is whether or not it bleeds or if it feathers. It's not doing that yet. So this is promising. I like this. Next up, I have from Bare Minerals. This is going to be their Lasting Matte Liquid Lipstick. We have this in the shade Spirited. This is a vegan, and this also says that the packaging is made from post-consumer recycled plastic. That's cool. So this is that they believe in clean, conscious, cruelty-free beauty. Now they're making their packaging more sustainable as well. And then the actual product is also vegan. So all really great things. I do love that a lot of beauty brands are starting tra to transition to things that are more eco-friendly. This is definitely going to be a traveler sample sized version. We'll do a quick swatch of this color. I like that this color should work with our cream blush that we got with the nude sticks. So this product is definitely a matte, a lot of color payoff when you put it down. And I definitely think it's going to give you a little bit of shine, even though it is a matte, there's still a little bit of shine to that. And my favorite part of the box is we have fragrances inside of it. So like I said, fragrances are just hard to receive in other subscription boxes. Macy's is pretty consistent with sending you something. So the first one that I have is from Valentino and this is the Born in Roma Coral Fantasy Fragrance. These are all just sample size cards so you'd only receive a small little vial. But again, these are so expensive that it's just nice to be able to try the scent out without having to spend $150 on the full size product. So this one is going to be a fruity, floral, and bright scent. It is orange and rose infused. And it says that this is gonna have a feminine flower but a slight masculine musk blend. And everyone will ask you, what are you wearing? The other fragrance that we have is also from Valentino. And this one is the Born in Roma Coral Fantasy. So this one must be like a slight variation. This one says that you're gonna have fruity notes in here and this is going to be a bright red apple and warm tobacco mixture. And this one is going to give you a signature scent. This one sounds a little bit more intense and bolder than the other one, but they both sound great. I think the item that we are missing was a MAC mascara, but we received a different MAC mascara inside of our box as a substitution. So the one that they were going to put in here was the MAC stack. And it says it's a viral sensation that's the most buildable, clump-free, and gravity-defying formula that will let your lashes go to the next level. So apparently this is a new mascara because I'm not familiar with this one, but instead of receiving that one, they sent this one instead. I'm okay with that though, because honestly, I like this one a lot. And like I said, it gives you great length on your lashes, so I don't think we necessarily missed out. And I don't think they sent you a bad product instead of it. So that is everything inside of my Macy's box for October. I like that we did receive a little bit of color in here with this blue liner. I just love this. I love the way it works. It looks beautiful. But honestly, I like my box a lot. I think there's some really good items. We have full size products in here. The nail polish is a nice sweet pink. I love that we have fragrances. 
I honestly think this is a really good box. And for $15 to receive all of these items, I still think you're making a good return on your money. Are you making the best return out there? No, but I don't think you're losing money either with these products. So comment down below, you guys, and let me know what you think, and we will chit chat all about it. But until next time, have a great rest of your day, and I will see you guys all in my next unboxing video. Bye!